You know my slogan, doesn't matter what state you're in, it only matters what state of mind you're in. Welcome back to Hive Mind Unlimited. Well, it's been a minute, guys, but we're gonna play a game here on Hive Mind Unlimited today. We're going to get a slogan that is a state's official slogan and try to guess what state it is. Easy. One point for each one we get right, me versus Graydon versus you. We don't even do that on this channel. It's no. just like you in general. Yeah, <laughs> all of you. Comment your favorite state down below. Comment your least favorite state down below. We're gonna do half the states in this video. And if you want the second half, 10,000 likes. First state slogan is, if you seek a pleasant peninsula, look about you. I know this one, but it doesn't make sense for the state. Pleasant Peninsula. Yeah, do you know what a Pleasant Peninsula is? I know what a peninsula is. And <laughs> you don't know what the word pleasant means? I am, I'm a little shaky on that. Oh, okay, nice, yeah, It's well, good. You know what a penin, well, explain a peninsula first. Peninsula is a piece of land surrounded by water. Not all the way. Though. Not all the way, it is yeah. landlocked. Yeah, it's like a protruding- um, Like a penis. Yeah, it's a, pe a penis. A land a, penis. A land penis, yeah, it's a penisula. This is too well worded for the state I'm thinking of though. <laughs> Well, what, what do you mean? I don't know. It's just like, look uh, about you. It's like they wouldn't <laughs> talk like that in the state I'm thinking about. Right, but they wrote these back when everybody talked like that. Like everything over here was still England at that point. <laughs> yeah, but they were talking like, <laughs> they'd still say stuff like this. That's true. They were all reading Shakespeare back then. We all listen to Drake now, you know? That's true. Three, two, one. Michigan. Florida? It is Michigan. Yeah. Yeah, we have like kind of a, pen like it's barely a peninsula. We're yeah. a peninsula? Well, the upper peninsula, UP. Well, the lower peninsula is a lower oh, peninsula Oh, it's like a too. mitten peninsula. It's surrounded by all the Great Lakes, man. That's true, yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, great. We got Latin. Excelsior. In excelsis Deo. Aria. In excelsis Deo. Sure. Yeah, Excelsior. It means like, my guess is it means forward. I thought it had something to do with spreadsheets. Three, two, one. Connecticut. I put Maryland. This is New York. Oh, okay. New York is Excelsior. Not like the Big Apple. Let's go Yanks. Go Yanks. <laughs> J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. What yeah. about that? Fuck Boston. Yeah, fuck Boston. <laughs> or I'm walking here. Say hi to your mother for me. I love that. <laughs> I love that. It also sounds like the name of a new energy drink that's supposed to be healthy. Yeah, or like a really stupid corporate nightclub. Oh, yeah. Like, you going to Excelsior tonight? Yeah, <laughs> no. I think I went there last weekend and the guys are so creepy. I don't think I'm going to go back. I'm going to go to Blue Dust tonight. <laughs> it's kind of a dive bar, but like the light is, it looks like an Aldo, you know? <laughs> oh, this one is North to the Future, which I'm assuming is a play on Back to the Future. Yeah, it must be, yeah. yeah. So it's gotta be a new state. <laughs> a state that came out in the 80s. <laughs> north to the Future. North to the Future! <laughs> what? I don't know, it's cool though. Three, two, one. North Dakota. Alaska. It is Alaska! Oh! Because they expanded north in the US, and yeah. like north to the future. Yeah. I see that and I like it now. It's I a think newer it's... state. I think it dropped in like 99. Yeah, 99, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Shout out Alaska from Drag Race too. Shout out Baked Alaska. Also a great dessert. Nice. I think. I don't know exactly what it is. <laughs> I don't is. know. It doesn't ring a bell. I don't me, know but... what it is. It's like something. <laughs> union, justice, and confidence. Also sound like famous people's kids. Oh, this is union. <laughs> this is justice. justice and confidence. Yeah, he's a couple months old. And... <laughs> <laughs> this could be any state because it's just some bullshit. This is like a school <laughs> slogan. It's like written on a crest up there. It's yeah. Fucking bullshit. Three, two, one. West Virginia. Delaware. This is Louisiana. Now, see, that's weird yeah. because- <laughs> I thought theirs would have been crawfish. Or confederacy, justice, and confidence. Oh, they were actually against the union. Right, like it's, it seems like a cover up. They were right. like, no, 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 our slogan's <laughs> union, justice, and confidence. Yeah. It should just be like parades or like- <laughs> Jazz. Go Saints. A lot of them should be sports team related. I yeah. feel like that's one thing that we're missing from this whole thing. Drew Brees' daddy. Uh, Lil Wayne, home of Lil Wayne. Home of Lil Wayne. Home of Lil Wayne. <laughs> oh. I actually have all three of those words tattooed in cursive on my ribs. Well. I just realized that, that's yeah, weird. Yeah, I have that angel who's like, his toga is like falling off and he's super ripped and he's holding the scales of truth and justice. I didn't ask for your whole life story. Well, it's just a tattoo I have on my ribs. I don't give a shit what you have on your ribs. This is related to the game. So let's keep it on track. 
<laughs> this one is the crossroads of America. <laughs> so you're just an intersection in America. Yeah. This isn't even like a, a brag. Yeah, so who's in the middle? That's what I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> hey, I'd rather be the crossroads of America than caught in the crosshairs of America. We True. are a very violent militaristic country. A lot of guns. <laughs> Imperialism and is like, it's rampant. A shit ton of guns. Yeah, so very sorry to yeah. everybody who does not live in America for everything that we've done. Yeah. But also, I mean... Sucks to suck. We're yeah. just kind of the best ones. <laughs> so that's really like fireworks, hot dogs, and country music. Yeah. I don't know what to tell you. Fuck yeah, with no. us and we'll kill you. Ford F-150. Hellfire missiles. <laughs> Dwayne yeah. The Rock Johnson. I don't know. Like, I, <laughs> sorry. Three, two, one. Kansas. Kansas. It is Indiana. I oh. almost guessed Indiana. And I, I know that people are going to say I'm lying, but I did think, what, what's the crossroads of America? Indiana is bullshit. I thought, it, going on there. I thought it would be home of the KKK since, you know, blank. Right, Gary, Indiana, that whole deal. What the hell? Let weapons yield to the toga. <laughs> Kind of like my tattoo. Yeah, I guess. Wow. <laughs> I shouldn't have stopped you. Yeah. My bad. That's like something you'd have to say at the door of a speakeasy yeah. to get in. <laughs> you'd go, <laughs> weapons yield to the toga. And they're Come like, on in. <laughs> Come on in. Come on in. Shh, shh, no phones. Three, two, one. Vermont. Massachusetts. This is Wyoming. <laughs> what? That makes sense. Nobody knows what they're doing over there. <laughs> Real hush hush business. There's like seven people that live in the state, so. Yield to the toga. I don't even care what it means. Yeah. I said just keep it moving. Let's keep it going. Yeah, I don't really like, give a shit. All right, next one is nothing without providence. This seems like a trick, right? Yeah. If it's not what we think it is, then it's a trick. Providence was a great TV show. Okay. Maybe it's about that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This state would be nothing without Providence. Great show. Yeah. You should watch it if you get a Slept chance. Slept on early 2000s drama. Three, two, one. Rhode Island. Pennsylvania. This is Colorado. Oh. It's not Providence, Rhode Island. Like, that's not what it's about. I thought Providence was in Pennsylvania, though. <laughs> <laughs> Just made sense to me. I said it in my mind three times. It said Providence, Pennsylvania. Providence, Pennsylvania. <laughs> Providence, Texas. No, nope. definitely Pennsylvania. <laughs> that's crazy. All for our country. Oh my god. Could we get any more vague? Like, they should have gotten more creative with this stuff. Right. I say we wipe the, the slate clean. Everybody starts over. Pick yeah. a new one and everybody votes on it and shit. And it's like on the internet so you can rig it. Right. And so it's like all hilarious. Yeah, this feels like a battle for who can be like the blandest. Three, two, one. Nebraska. Tennessee. This is Nevada. What? Nothing about gambling at all. Should be like, feeling lucky, question mark? Or roll the dice. Oh, Surprisingly no. great mountain biking. That's a good slogan for them. See, yeah, they're not bringing people in. This is all yeah. for our country? Like, who's gonna go to Nevada and be like, oh, I'm glad it said that? <laughs> Like, what do you mean? You it got so much make... stuff to advertise. Yeah. Like, how about Nicolas Cage lives here? You Brand... wouldn't expect him to. Gordon Ramsay has 15 restaurants. In total or in Nevada? In Nevada. Oh, okay, cool. Frank Sinatra used to fuck here. <laughs> That's yeah. perfect. To the stars through difficulties. Ah, I know this one. Oh. Who be going to the stars, though? Boom. I <laughs> Boom. feel that. I feel that. Space rockets is where I'm thinking. The problem here, though, is like the stars. Like it could be like it could be the stars. Celebrities. Celebs. You know where they live, right? <laughs> yeah, but you don't bring up their difficulties. You gloss over them. And you forget about them as quick as possible in order to love their next movie. You do the same thing with their difficulties that you do with their lip fillers. Gloss over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Three, two, one. Florida? Houston. <laughs> Kansas never went to the moon. Kansas didn't do anything. Well, um. Oh, sorry. They did win the national championship a few times. Maybe, uh. Okay. <laughs> maybe, um, Buzz Aldrin's from there. <laughs> is he? I don't know. I think he's actually from Ohio. I think he is too. He's a bad guy too. Had like a 19 year old wife when he died. <laughs> he was like 99. <laughs> I think he was, I think that's the actual gap. I think he was 80 years older than his wife. <laughs> he, some would say he's light years older than her. <laughs> you should use Kansas as a testing zone for nuclear bombs. <laughs> I, agree. I completely it should, agree. Like, we should be able to stand at the border of Kansas, big glass wall, and then just drop a nuke every day. You can go watch it whenever you want. And for everybody that's worried about the surrounding states like Nebraska and all of those, also don't care. Yeah, yeah, yeah don't like, care. That's like fine. Yep. <laughs> Bomb them. <laughs> hey, this game, the good thing about it is that it's going to get easier as it goes because it is going to get narrowed down as long as we remember. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess. Houston's off the board. <laughs> oh, wait. Kansas is off the board. <laughs> I wrote that genuinely, too. G you thought Houston was a state. I didn't really think that. I just <laughs> wrote it. I just, I didn't think about it. <laughs>
<laughs> okay, next slogan is liberty and union, now and forever, one and inseparable. Blah, 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 blah. Isn't this like the in the Pledge of Allegiance? Liberty and union and peace and justice and every man's equal, except for some, and especially not women, and <laughs> yeah. anybody else that wants to consider themselves whatever else they want. If you're any of those, we got a problem, but for every white man, you know, liberty and union and justice and freedom and forever and one and inseparable. And guns and beer and steak. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Washington, D.C. Texas. This is North Dakota. Oh, what? This is a big ass proclamation for a fucking nowhere man's land. Yeah. <laughs> Who are you to claim liberty, union, and justice? They didn't claim justice. Well, whatever. Just I'm just mixing up union. the other one. Good place for a felon to hang out. That should be the slogan. <laughs> <laughs> they ain't gonna find you here. <laughs> we don't even care. We don't even have police officers. <laughs> <laughs> we got oil workers and hobos. And yeah, you can still <laughs> call them that up there because they're riding trains and they literally have the sticks with the checkered bags on them. Checkered bags are usually bandanas? No, they're like bags uh, from checkers. <laughs> Used up checkers bags. rallies <laughs> bags. Used to have curly fries in them, now they got my shoes. <laughs> Quality before the law. Equality before the law. Yeah, like equality before the law. So it's like before as in like standing before the law, not like <laughs> equality comes first and then the law. <laughs> yeah, Maybe that's... not. Maybe it is that. I don't know. Three, two, one. Oklahoma. Vermont. This is Nebraska. It was close. It was close. It was in the basin. <laughs> I didn't smell it. It was in the right basin. You ever been to Nebraska? No, I would really like to go though. And I know that I just talked about exploding it. Well, exploding Kansas and <laughs> yeah. then whatever happened in Nebraska, I was fine with it. It's collateral damage, not a big deal to me. Yeah. I do want to go to Connor Roberts Bar in Nebraska. Oh, I I think there is a Bob Dylan museum there. And now all of a sudden you care. So when it's my favorite artist, you don't give a shit. You said explode it. And then no, I said explode Kansas. And then you said whatever happens to nope, Nebraska. No, you said that. And then you said you don't give a shit about my favorite artists and you don't like me. You said one of those is true. You said fuck Connor Oberst and fuck Elliot Smith. And then you said, oh, wait, Bob Dylan museum's there now. We should save the state from nuclear bombing. Listen, I don't care, man. No fucking way. <laughs> Just the word industry. That's it. Industry. I can't believe this. These one word ones are legendary. Like they did not, they sat down they're like, oh, just one, one word. Just industry. Industry. They're like what about the state that supports industry? No, just industry. The wings of freedom that soar upon high. And they're like, no, money. That should be the slogan. <laughs> industry. <laughs> Cash. Three, two, one. West Virginia. That's what I guessed. This is Utah. Okay. The industry of what? Polygamy? Should have been. Come get your bunch of wives. Minimum diversity. This one is May the 14th star shine bright. And now we got a fucking quiz on what the 14th state was. Because the 14th star in the flag, blah, blah, blah. The 14th, who gives a shit? May number 27. Point five. Shine the second brightest. Ever. 27 and a half. <laughs> Puerto Rico. Okay, whatever. Love the people of Puerto Rico. <laughs> I spoke to the president of Puerto Rico. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. We love the people of Puerto Rico. <laughs> I love when Donald Trump discovers that a word is fun to say. Because yeah. you can feel he it. And that it is electric. Yeah. Transubstantiation. <laughs> oh, I want to see him find that one. That's right. The Christians love me. They really do. They love me. And you know what else they love? They love transubstantiation. <laughs> me, I said, whoa, whoa, whoa. Trans? But then I learned what it was. <laughs> now I love it. I gobble up the flesh of Jesus. That's transubstantiation. Trans is when a boy becomes a girl, and transubstantiation is when a boy becomes a wafer. <laughs> Three, two, one. North Carolina. Georgia? This is Vermont. You just guessed that one. Yeah, thanks. I, I was just telling you. I mean, I it's, know I did. See, that's what I was thinking. Like, it couldn't be up there. I thought it had because to trickle it down. Trickle down. <laughs> yeah. I thought Maybe. they would be done naming the states yeah. up there, and they'd be like, "What's down here?" This is another old one. Thus, always to tyrants. This is using thus like, oh, like I've never seen it used. I've heard <laughs> thus like and also or like a consequence like thus this happened right. I don't know. I've always seen it used as just an abbreviation for Thursday. Thuz. Thuz Day. <laughs> it sounds like the name of a math rock band. Three, two, one. Delaware. Mass. This is Virginia. I almost uh, said Virginia, that. Virginia, the volunteer, or whatever. What? The muskets and the hoo-ha and the, <laughs> and the shooting and the blood. What? The genocide of indigenous people. Whatever, dude. Yeah, that's uh, like old, what most of America is about. The so. old country. This one is, she flies with her own wings. What state's full of girls? <laughs> 
More than half the U.S. is girls. What if, like, some states were all girls? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I grew up in an all-boys state. <laughs> I don't know. My parents went there. Well, one of them went there, my dad. And he wanted me to go there. Just kind of like I didn't really have like a choice. But it was honestly cool for me. I mean, it wasn't that big of a deal. Yeah. You know? I'd see the girls on, on vacations and I'd be like, oh, girl. <laughs> dad, is that a... And he's like, don't look, son. Girl. <laughs> All girls state would be like the most peaceful place oh it'd be awesome <laughs> all boys states be like a, a fight fest yeah <laughs> a lot of bars three two one north carolina that's what i put this is oregon Going with the aviation thing yeah the wright brothers yeah first in flight would have been the Wright sisters i guess if it was if she flies <laughs> with her own wings yeah you know what this brings up something i wanted to talk about go ahead of course it's never okay to objectify women right but it's always okay to womanify objects like a lamp, you go, oh, she is awesome. Or a boat, classically. You know? Oh, shit, look at her. Look, look at, at her. her. She's done right <laughs> look by at that, me. baby. Yeah, yeah, She's yeah. She's done right by me, But brother. literally anything. Like, it could be a dress, a card, a painting. Anything could be a she. You just, like... We manify him, though, too. Look at this little fella right here. Oh, no, look at this guy. That's an animal. No, people say that about things all the time. Like? Toss me that guy. That, that dude. <laughs> Let me see that little dude. People say that. I don't think so. Yeah, they do. If you're digging through your couch cushions looking for the remote, you're going, where is she? No, you're not. Yes, you are. No, you could just, you could say, ah, oh, there he goes. And you grab it. There he goes. You're forcing this. No, not. no, 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 no. You're forcing this super hard. I would say that. No, you wouldn't. Or like another beer at a bar. I'd say, give me another little guy. No, you just say. I wouldn't say. You'd say, give me another one. And they'd say, sir, you've already had 16. I can't serve you. <laughs> You say, yeah, no, 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 give no. me that. <laughs> give me that or I'm going to kill you. Or give me a cold boy. Cold one. No, cold boys. I, you've never said that. I, a six pack I hang out boys. with you all the time. You never say stuff like that. <laughs> Guys, I just picked up a nice 24 rack of little boys. Listen, and I'm going to bring them over and we're going to slurp them down. I hate to expose you this way, but you are way more likely to say, pick up a six pack of them bitches. <laughs> And listen, not like that, but I'm I'm not trying to, but I'm just saying, you know, you're like, oh, that bitch is nice. That's what you'll say about like a slice of fish. I would also say that boy's slapping. You don't say that. You're just making that part up to I try to- I'd serve you a plate and I'd say, Mr. Food coming in. Mr. Food. <laughs> Yes, I would. <laughs> President Cheeseburger just landed. <laughs> Presidents can be women too, just not yet. Yeah, well, probably never too. <laughs> and I'm just saying, it's like, it's not me. The whole country votes. I would vote for a woman, and I did. Once. <laughs> saying the country as a whole, we'll have a gay Chinese guy as president before we have a woman. And I stand on that. It's just the truth. Also, another thing I'd call a beer. Give me a glass of truth. <laughs> <laughs> I've been lied to all week. Give me a glass of truth. We dare to defend our rights. This one's good. This one's like like the Beastie Boys, right? You gotta fight for your right to parlay. Wasn't that ACDC? I think it was the Beastie Boys, man. Pretty sure that was ACDC. How about we truth to defend our rights? How about we truth to say who we'd want to make out with in the room? You first. Okay. Who? Bobby Moynihan. You know his corpse is under the studio. First of all, Bobby Moynihan is very much alive. Number two, that's not a corpse under there. It's a mannequin from Sears. Well, you can call mannequins corpses. It works either way. No, it well not. Once you die, you become kind of a mannequin. Oh, that's the real mannequin challenge. Is dying. <laughs> Black beetles in the city. Be back immediately to confiscate the money. He is so good at the mannequin challenge. Look at yeah. him. He didn't move an inch. Three, two, one. Florida. Texas. This is Alabama. Who knew this game would be so difficult? Alabama Barker. New song out at midnight. Go stream it. Travis Travis Barker's daughter, Bama? Her new song's actually fire, bro. You need to check it out. Go stream that shit. Anything else? Kourtney Kardashian's a great stepmom. I wish she was my real mom. I wish she was Alabama's real mom. Okay. Is there anything else? You don't sound super enthused about anything you're saying, but it seems like you have to say it, I guess. Landon Barker's actually a pretty chill dude, and his music's kind of sincere and fire as well. I hope he collabs with his sister one day soon. Maybe even a family track. Maybe they could be like the new Willie Nelson's family band, the Barker band. It's like pop punk fused with hip hop. It's awesome. I'm so happy those genres collided the way they did. All around fire music. Virtue, liberty, and independence. Ah! Oh, I have two of these three words tattooed in cursive on my ribs. 
Actually, all three. Forgot. Independence is in Chinese, though. We can all agree that the slogans themselves are getting boring, right? Nobody <laughs> yeah. cares about that part of it yeah. anymore. So we really got to step it up. We got to tell jokes. I, I got one for yeah, you. Yeah, go for it. Is Big Chungus a state? <laughs> Joke. It made me laugh, I guess, yeah. so it counts. But Fuck you. That yeah. was a good joke. No, yeah, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah, you can ask if anything's a state. I guess. Yeah. Oh. Are boobies a state? I wish. Big Bahunga Chungas. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually going down to my cottage this weekend in Big Bahunga Chungas. When everyone was still an ass man, I bought a place down there and prices were cheap. Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one. I put Illinois. I put Rhode Island. <laughs> This is Pennsylvania. Yeah, of course it is. That's state. I think that we should do guess the state from a list of cities in it. <laughs> We'd probably get some points on that one. Yeah. Hey, we're all learning a lot though. We're all learning how boring <laughs> slogans are and like the few interesting ones now we all know. I hope that you guys are entertained. Let's go. Oh, the star of the North. This is a combination of two too. The stars one and North to the future, which I still can't believe. Yeah, North to the future is awesome. <laughs> I'm also learning that I don't know how to spell. Right. <laughs> Someone should have stopped me in high school. Didn't you stop yourself from going to high school? Right. Oh, but okay, like, they, yeah. I guess they should have been like, hey, not so good at things. <laughs> Did they not tell you that? I thought they told you that. No, I was on an honor roll roll. You were on an honor? You were, wait. I was on an honor roll roll. I was on a roll of being on the honor roll. <laughs> oh, God. That's <laughs> like confused. four straight semesters. How are you so good at tongue twisters and so bad at spelling and speaking I, I and know. thinking? I don't know. Three, two, one. Montana. Minnesota. It is Minnesota! Fuckers. <laughs> I thought theirs was like land of 10,000 lakes or whatever. Land of 10,000, shut the hell up, let's go. How are they the star of the north? Well, they're the next most northern state besides Alaska. And Maine, maybe, it goes a little higher, but Maine doesn't consider itself like north. Minnesota's cold. Okay, sorry. Cold like Minnesota. Oh, look at this, <laughs> our old favorite words. This one is liberty and independence. Wow. <sighs> liberty, union, independence, law, equality, freedom, taxes. Fuck, man. <laughs> Did they not check with each other on these slogans? They didn't call them up and be like, what are you guys doing? <laughs> they're like, oh, we're doing virtue and liberty and independence. And they're like, oh, okay, we're just doing liberty and, in and independence. <laughs> and they're like, no, that's fine. Yeah, yeah you're nah, good. That's fine. We'll Let just do it. Yeah, yeah. And what are, what's the other one doing? They're doing union liberty and independence. <laughs> oh, okay. Cool. Three, two, one. West Virginia. DC. It is Delaware. We got one of the letters. <laughs> <laughs> so did I. W for in Delaware. Okay. Yeah, there's a W in there. I didn't know if it was two V's next to each other. <laughs> well, I have a V too, so then I have two. Well, I didn't know if the, the W in Delaware was just two V's next to each other. <laughs> no, I know. Yeah, I'd have one either way, but... Yeah. Live free or die. I know this one. Oh, yeah, we learned this one in the, the yeah. license plate one. This is also a Bruce Willis movie. No, oh, hard. Live, live free or die hard. <laughs> Justin Long's in that movie. Live hard or die soft. But it's Bruce Willis and Justin Long, and Justin Long falls in love with Bruce Willis's daughter, and Bruce Willis approves of Justin in the end because he's a hero, and it's like they're doing like a fire sale. So they're like taking out all the government computers, and they're like opening both sides of the tunnel, and like and saying that both cars can go that way, so they all crash in the middle. It's like a bunch of cool ass shit that they're doing, and it's an awesome movie, and I hope Bruce Willis's family is doing well. And shout out to Justin Long. Once again, you're welcome on the show anytime. Please, 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 please come on the show. Three, two, one. New Hampshire. That's what I put. It is New Hampshire. Finally, we learned something from another video. I like just remembered that that was a state. I was yeah. trying to think of that one in the last one. <laughs> yeah. and I was like, what's that other little son of a bitch up there? <laughs> See what you did there? Oh wait, son is a man. See? Shit. See you're, what right, I mean? you're right, you're right. Yeah, you manified it. You manified it, yeah. What the fuck? Now this one's freaky. Grow and multiply? Okay. Grow and multiply. So what, wait, what are you, yeah, what are you doing as a state that's grow and multiply? <laughs> is it maybe like it's a breeding state? That's where they try to get people to breed? A fuck, a fuck fest. Yeah, it's a fuck fest state. Yeah. But the thing is, it's like, is the state supposed to grow and multiply? Is there anywhere that, Hawaii, I guess, they could. There's a lot of space out there to do that. Volcanoes, yeah. they could get new islands. I just don't know. Three, two, one. Washington, the I, state. I actually put Washington too. <laughs> it is Maryland. It would have been Old Bay Seasoning. Sick flag. Home of the Cuff Boys. I like Maryland as a state name. Yeah, it should have been like Maryland. The merriest of the lands. All right, this one is our liberties we prize and our rights we will maintain. Oh, 
God, so boring. Where are the syntax clues? There's nothing about it. It's just no. literally like, this is just about America. It's just yeah. like, oh, like we... They put the Bill of Rights in a blender and then just stuck words <laughs> to the wall. <laughs> yeah, they made a ransom note out of the Constitution. <laughs> oh, we got liberty again. <laughs> Throw that in there. We will maintain our rights. It's like, yeah. This is what people cared about when they were wearing white wigs and shit. Yeah. Well, our liberties we will prize and our rights we will maintain. And nowadays I'm like, kind of want a PS5. Yeah. Do you guys want to go to a strip club tonight? Yes. <laughs> Should I do cocaine if I did Adderall earlier? <laughs> That's what I'm thinking about. When's that new movie come out? You know, the one with that one guy. Three, two, one. Connecticut. Maine. This is Iowa. I thought it had to be way closer to New England because that's where they care about all the rights and the stuff. I wish it'd be Field of Dreams. I guess. I, yeah. It, it should. It should. Because they got a f they got cornfields and shit and then also Field of Dreams movie. Kevin Costner is a handsome fucker. I mean, absolutely. <laughs> wish he was my dad. Has anybody looked better in a pair of blue jeans? Maybe Alan Jackson. But that's if you like mustaches. And Brett Favre, if you like tax evasion. I do. Yeah. And I like a quarterback who's not afraid to take a risk. That guy threw a lot of picks, but... <laughs> He led the league in picks like seven times, or yeah. four times actually, four times. Hall of Famer though, undisputed. Oh, absolutely. The welfare of the people is the highest law. This one you gotta admit's pretty sick. It is kind of right? sick. Like yeah. this one's kind of cool. And it's also like pre-modern context of welfare for sure. Oh, definitely. You know, this yeah. is like welfare. I hope you're doing all right. <laughs> yeah, welfare. This means just like health in general. Yeah. Like, oh, well, you gotta be all right. Yeah. Welfare now means something completely different. EBT points are the highest law. Food stamps of the people <laughs> are the highest law. America doesn't give a shit about poor people anymore. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> What's that? It's a little ditty. I've been singing a little melody. Okay. I'm gonna write something to it later. All right, give it to me again. I'll write with you. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Never mind, I can't write to that. It sucks. No, it's beautiful. Sorry, right? it's beautiful. You're right. Thank you. Three, two, one. South Carolina. Kentucky. This is Missouri. Forgot about that place. Like yeah. I got bopped in New Missouri one time. You got bopped in Missouri? Yeah, by the feds. Uh, okay, do you want to continue? Not really. Ah, all right, that's it. Not a great place to get in trouble. That's just usually how you like start a story. Yeah, maybe a fictional one. Oh, okay, so this is, you want it to be real. It is real. Oh, I, I didn't want it to be real, but it happened. Oh, my bad. Now, hold on a second. United we stand, divided we fall. I want to say that this is something else. Something like else a Blink-182 song or something? No, isn't this just the U.S. slogan? Like, isn't this the whole United States slogan, right? I thought it was the militaries. No. <laughs> okay. No. What's the militaries, then? I don't know. It's not this. Okay, Jesus. I know the Marines is the few, the, the proud. Yeah. The Marines. Air Force is a... Uh, Two and a half men, the Charlie Sheen version. <laughs> That's the whole slogan? That's the Air Force's slogan, yeah. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. The Navy's is a uh, Steve Irwin was an American hero. You thought he's Australian? Yeah. That's, it doesn't make it's any sense. It's controversial, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, well, yeah. Are you all right? And the What's north. Going on? The, the, You're talking in like a slow way that the, makes me think you like sipped lean or something. The Coast Guard. <laughs> right, yeah. I've which heard is of a it. branch of the military. Their slogan yeah. is Steve Winwood for three deep downtown cash. <laughs> Steve That's, Winwood, the singer of Higher Love? Yeah. Give me your higher love. Steve Winwood from downtown, yes, cash. <laughs> That's cool. I like that. But it's not true. There's no way it's true. Sorry. The Marines. You already said the Marines. Is tapioca pudding it's weird texture? It's not. It's not the Marines. You already said the Marines. The few, the proud, the Marines. I didn't say that. Just wake up. Please wake up. <laughs> Three, two, one. DC. Illinois. This is Kentucky. No, it's not. Kentucky don't care about shit like this. They're getting drunk for cheap. I thought theirs was United We Stand, Divided We Ball. Yeah. Like for like, cause it's like Jack Harlow. Kentucky blue on these hoes. Yeah, Jack Harlow. Last one. Whoa, I like it. Prepared in minds and resources. Yeah. Wow. We are not gonna remember which ones were in this one when we play part two. No, I'd like to have a board. A list of the ones that we've used so An far. Elimination so we bank. have just 25. I feel like we'll do pretty well in that one. Yeah, and actually, no, have to no do way. better. There's just no way we will. <laughs> oh shit. Who the hell's smart? Yeah, and most of the states that have excess resources are dumbasses. And so to have both seems like a rare commodity. Three, two, one. Massachusetts. That's what I guessed. Is South Carolina. They are not smart. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. This one is a 
lie. This yeah. is another lie that they have going on. Prepared in minds my ass. We both guessed Massachusetts because of MIT. Harvard. Yeah. Harvard. <laughs> Same difference. Yeah. So you win this one three to two. Fucker. So get this video to 10,000 likes if you want to see part two with the 25 other states. Show love to your favorite states and least favorite states down below too. Other than that, make sure you like the videos and subscribe. All this stuff I did not say at the beginning. And Graydon, would you like to leave the wonderful people with some advice to leave their lives by? In pursuit of more time on this earth, or money, be satisfied with one or the other. All right, this has been High Mind Unlimited. We love you, appreciate you, and we'll see you in the next one. And also liberty and justice and confidence and, and union. And independence. And independence. And peace. And peace. And peace.